Bye. <laughs> Yesterday I didn't do a vlog anymore, but we went to the hotel and just slept. And I guess I go to the hotel to find someone and later go to Luke. And, well, let's see if the day is better than yesterday, hopefully. So I'm waiting to Molly, I think, are coming as well, so I'm not alone. Looks up. Luke's big day is today. I'm so excited for him. I can't wait to see him later. Um, yeah, basically, we're waiting for Kian stalking us. And I'm talking so quietly because there are like literally about 60 people here. Head out. Waiting for. I don't know. Ollie White's getting mocked. He's literally getting mocked. Poor guy. Poor Ollie getting mocked. But I got my picky and I finally met Ollie and I'm like happy. And there are so many people like look around. You look around and there are everywhere people. I don't know. But everyone's like was like running. And now Ollie's getting mocked, but he's such a sweetheart. Taking time for everyone. And everywhere people and basically everyone's living through the car park and there's no point in meeting anyone anymore and there are like about 200 people I guess and Kian left already so I'm never gonna meet Kian in my life and it's so upsetting I'm not alone anymore well, <laughs> but basically, yeah, we're just like walking around the hotel. And what's wrong with you guys? <laughs> well, I'm with Molly and Am. I really want to meet someone, but uh, we met Ollie and <laughs> Kian left, and I'm so upset. And Matt left, and also. everyone's left. And I don't want to leave. I met Ollie. Ollie is not. Oh, he's not hard to get. <laughs> so basically, we just were stuck in the hotel, literally. And then we looked down, and there were Ricky, Andrew, and Jen. And now we're walking with them. And it's so, so, so nice. It's getting off, but I have so much fun. Like, I'm like, what am I even doing? Just being like happy that I'm seeing them. <laughs> so basically, I feel so bad. Flying and I'm like, happy girl ever. And, uh. I'm walking. I feel like a YouTuber already. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Someone save me. They're all staring at me. How do they do this? I just end up telling them to like go away or something. Sylvia, you can have this back now. Hiya. So, just took pictures. I want a camera like that. And I need to leave in like latest 30 minutes to go see Luke, but I don't want to go. But, well, I have no internet. Hi. There are some cool people. Ain't no wifey. And we got kicked out of the hotel, so we're just chilling on the roof somehow, or whatever it is. So, I'm literally, I was just on my way to the train station, and guess who I just found? I found Ricky and Andrew and Jens over there. Again, and I really wasn't supposed to see them. I was just like, being there. And yeah, basically, that just made my day. I don't care that I come late to see Luke. I don't know. I'm just happy because Ricky's my queen. And basically, ah. And I'm just gonna going to see Jen now because I basically yeah. And 
I got the Nisha video for Ricky. Um, yeah. I feel stalked. Like, I literally said I need to go to the Piccadilly line to go to see Luke. And I guess we just walk, like, behind me. Ricky, Andrew, and Jen. And now they're getting the tube as well. But I think they're going in the other direction. No, they're going in the same direction as me. Oh my god, that's like so weird. Basically, I'm on the same tube as Molly, but Molly is like over there and I'm like over here. And that's like a bit annoying, but I, I really didn't want to get this tube. But I didn't mean to go in there with that, but well, basically, Ricky and Andrew and Jenna. Are you making a YouTube? Well, I didn't know that Molly was there. I thought she was back at the hotel, but she's basically here. And Bit of annoying. No, it's not annoying, but it's weird. Court. And I lost my credit card Change basically on the street. The and everyone was looking at me. Elf Court like, oh my God. Yeah. So I basically just arrived at King's Cross. I don't know where to go now because I don't know the way. But like literally at Leicester Square, um, Ricky, Jen, and Andrew got off and everyone else got off with them and they still got off and I'm, I feel so bad for them. Andrew looked like he's going to have a panic attack any moment. Ricky looked around panicking all the time. He couldn't even see the chair. Everyone's squishy. I don't know what to do. I feel so bad for them because they just want to see London. It's the first time here and I don't know. I feel so, so bad for them. And I'm gonna try to come away now. Uh, oh my god. Um, so basically we just want something to eat because I didn't eat in two days. And now I'm here with Lina and Chrissy because Chrissy came as well. And yeah, now we're at the, this lovely church.
when you're in an industry like this, it's not easy. And you know, you always get people that are trying to bring you down, try and make you think that things are never going to happen. I'm not saying I've made it, because I, I, I know that I have a very, very long way to go. And even if that is, it's like a one in a million chance that something does happen. There's so many people trying to do this, and it's basically a song which is about fighting for your dreams and what you believe in, and to never stop, and always give it 100% effort, because you just never know. You might just get lucky. So. Thank you, thank you. My little speech right there. It's, it's, it's appropriate, though. So, basically, it's after the gig, and... Okay. Well, let's all go in there. Yeah, let's all go in there. Tell everyone from the crowd here. You go in. It's alright. Alright. So, we're here. It's being weird. Oh, nice. Someone's having fun. Someone just something. texted me, uh, like, uh, no, the and was like, oh, Team Charla going hard. Right. <laughs> I just had some salami. And it was lovely. It was very salami. Oh, come on! It's the best thing of John. Salami, yeah. ja. <laughs> Salami smack, smackt nicht mm -mm. gut. Get off, Molly! He doesn't want to say hi. He hates me. Alicia, will this make you smile? That's exactly. She's laughing. But, well, I have Tyler Oakley, that's better anyway. I hope you heard that. <laughs> We went and I said bye to everyone and just nice. went our own ways and then I was like chilling for over an hour at Victoria and now I'm finally on the couch back home so I'll be home like 2.30 a.m. or something uh, yeah. But it was so worth it, I'm so proud of you, like, seriously. Like, if you haven't heard of Luke Tyler yet, go check him out, because he's a babe, and you have to. I don't give you any choice, you have to check him out. I'm gonna put the link to his channel down below. Home and well, I'm gonna go home now. No, like, I I'm gonna go in York. Ah, like, I don't know, I chill now. Because yes. I'll sleep yeah, well, or whatever. Thank you for watching. And like, subscribe, comment below. Whatever. Just whatever you like. How, how do you like, do you like this? If you check them out. Like, now, now. What so do you think about it? <laughs> and and yeah. So, thank you for watching. And bye.